All right, so I feel like I need to do a life update because this vlog is kind of like everywhere. So first off, I'm gonna run some clips right now, which Haley and I took a trip home this past weekend because we just wanted to like see family, friends, and things like that. So I'll show you all that now. All right, so originally I was not going to vlog anything this weekend, but Haley and I decided to come home and we made a huge Trader Joe's haul. So I figured, you know what, I'm gonna show you what we got. So basically we got anything that said pumpkin on it. I kid you not. We have pumpkin pancake mix. Not gonna make this right now. I don't want pancakes right now, but I also got uh, pumpkin cereal bars. I'm gonna use these as like a post-workout carb source. We have pumpkin chocolate chunk oatmeal cookie mix. Uh, not making that yet either. And then we have maple and sea salt kettle corn. So all those things I just showed you, I'm not having just yet, but right now I'm going to have pumpkin flavored Jojo's. Okay. Maple leaf cookies, sounds delicious and then butternut squash mac and cheese. So I just made this. So we're gonna try the cookies while that cools down because it is like piping hot. I'm gonna just sit you right here. I made her buy this. Literally it's the only reason I wanted to go to Trader Joe's. Yeah. She really wanted me to try this uh, the mac butternut and cheese. Squash, yeah. All right. If anybody was wondering. Oh yeah, she... I got this eyeball. Why can I not get this out? Okay. So JoJo's are essentially Oreos. And this is their pumpkin one, so. Mmm, their cream is really good. Like it's much creamier than an Oreo would be. I really like that. Mm hmm All right, next up is gonna be the maple leaf cookies. This one is also a cream-based cookie, like a sandwich cookie. All right. That thing's kind of pretty big. Mmm. Oh, that's good. That's really good. This tastes like... Good? Like a pancake. Like, the cookie itself tastes like a pancake, like it's so much maple flavor. And then the cream is like... It's just good. This one gets like 10 out of 10. The uh, the Oreo one gets probably a 7 out of 10. I wish it was a little bit more flavorful, but still really good. All right. We've had our dessert. Yeah, you have that lot of mixing flavors. Okay. Butternut squash mac and cheese. Oh, that hits. Is it good? Oh, that's really good. <laughs> oh, I can get down with the mac and cheese. Okay. Mac and cheese. <laughs> I'm gonna give 10 out of 10. I don't have any complaints on it. That's really good. Maple leaf cookies, really good. The JoJo's are all right. Like it's a good flavor. The cream is very, very good, but I need more flavor from it. So, all right, there's my three little reviews. Once we get back to Blacksburg, I'll show you all everything else. But yeah, figured I'd go ahead and just somewhat vlog. This is on a phone, so it's probably not the greatest quality. I figured I'd try one more thing for y'all. This is the Hold the Cone uh, Pumpkin Ginger. They're like the ends of like yeah. the ice creams. Okay, give them a shot. Oh, they're they're much bigger than I thought. I thought they were gonna be like super small. Am I supposed to, how am I supposed to you like, swiftly eat this? You like just bite into the ends and it's like a multiple bite thing. Oh, okay. I'm gonna stress some of you people out really quick. This doesn't bother me. They also have this in vanilla and chocolate. Ooh, that's a lot of pumpkin. <laughs> oh, I'm a big pumpkin person, but holy smokes. I'm destroying this box. Like you can, I think you're supposed to have, how many is the serving size? Three. Okay, you're supposed to have- No, two and a half. No, three, 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 sorry. Okay, so you can eat up to three of these, but this specific flavor, I definitely am like one and done. This is just like a bunch of pumpkin, so gonna have this one it's good it's just you're gonna fatigue on it very swiftly so i'd rate these probably like 6.5 out of 10. second off i got in the new cotton candy sour strips not gonna lie didn't rock with them i would give them like three or two i probably like a five out of ten like it's just the flavor the sourness is is okay but the flavor itself is like super artificial 
like extremely artificial. I just don't rock with it. Um, life update number three. I feel like I never told y'all, but I did find a job. I'm not going to tell y'all where yet because, you know, internet, safety, things like that. But I found a job. And, yeah, now I feel like I can kind of go on with this vlog because I feel like I just... It was just taking too many roller coasters. So, also, we finally got our TV stand so we can officially start decorating for fall. I'm going to actually... So, the cords, I really hate. Um... I'm no professional, but I can kind of like figure out, I'm going to like zip tie them to where it's all like clean and tidy back there. I don't rock with the strummy cords like that. Um, Haley and I are basically matching. <laughs> Speaking of, you can see that we are in, I'm, this is like a Columbia jacket. It's freezing. Last oh, week, yeah, like 40 degrees. <laughs> last week it was in the like 70s still. It felt really good. You could feel it was like transitioning into fall, but no, it's full, full blown fall here now. Like this morning was 48 degrees. So oh, I don't think it's much different right now. Yeah, it's still pretty chilly outside. So I'm cool with it. I'm excited. This, this vase didn't work. That's not what we wanted. Um, I just keep it in this. Okay. But yeah, so it's cold out now. <laughs> I haven't I haven't vlogged in a few days. <laughs> taking my coffee to go. By the way, I got this cup from Walmart for 50 cents. Doesn't spill when I drink it. Um, and this grip is actually really nice. Like the cup was really, really hot when I put the coffee in, but the grip actually didn't get hot. So good 50 cent purchase. But anyways, I took the coffee to go because Haley and I have a ton of errands to run. By the way, I'm back on my phone vlogging because none of my SD cards are formatting like I need them to. Great, thanks so much for that SD cards, but like I said, Haley and I are running a bunch of errands today. She's in this like club thing at Tech and they do sort of like a big little thing. It's not exactly big little, but it, it's something like that. I don't really know. So we have to go drop off all these baskets. After we drop off the big little basket things, Haley and I need to go to Target and you need to go to Michael's? Five below. Five below, same thing. But yeah, so we have errands to run and that's what we're doing for the day. So I went to Duncan. Um, on campus and I got Morgan a surprise and they're the um oh they're the munchkins the, the apple cider and then the pumpkin so I, I love all things yeah apple cider and pumpkin I keep telling her I want to give her these so finally did um I honestly don't really know the difference between each one so hopefully what I tell her is actually what she gets I think this is the pumpkin this is the pumpkin yeah I just want this bag to be a candle. So they're good, but the pumpkin tastes like like an afterthought. Like you don't get the pumpkin till after you like chew and swallow it. That's what an afterthought is. Yeah, but I mean, it's good. I'd give it like a seven out of 10. All right. Mm. Sounds good. Kind of smells just like regular. Jelly. The pumpkin smells better. Mmm. This is the winner. <laughs> Did you not like that one? Apple cider is 10 out of 10. That's extremely good. Yeah, they taste like a regular donut. I don't like pumpkin things, and I just taste like a regular donut. I get the apple. I don't know. They all just kind of... Uh, I get the apple now. I think the apple cider is really good. Uh-huh. Here's one. Here's one. Okay. Okay. Um, that. Um, large, um, or large vanilla ice latte with oat milk. If you're still drinking almond milk, get on the oat milk grind. Okay. Now we're going into five below because Haley wants a decorative blanket and then we'll probably go to Target. We got home from running errands and got a package. Oh, got a package. 
I feel like I always have a package when I'm doing a vlog. Um, but you can never have too much coffee. Thing just got stuck. I almost broke my nail. Alright, let's see what we got. This one, put it out for a shot. This is what I'm excited for. It's their pumpkin spice. Um, well, it's actually pumpkin spice cake, but I'm extremely excited for it. It's limited edition. There's three of them. I don't think I bought three. I think this order's wrong. Oh boy. Uh, hold on. Uh oh. Okay. I think they jacked up the order. What is this? This box is like never ending of surprises. Enjoy a complimentary sleeve with your next order of any 50 plus capsules. 50? Miss Presser's really trying to play me. What is this? I think Nespresso sent the wrong person the wrong thing. <laughs> There's this like envelope. Oh, and some samples. I'm not mad. I got a bunch of coffee. I think that the order's wrong though, so. All right, I feel like I just rambled on about coffee for way too long, but anyways. Um, this vlog, I know, it's like a roller coaster. It's been up and down and up and down. It's kind of all over the place. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. If you enjoyed it, please smash that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, turn that little bell on so you get all my post notifications, and I will see you in the next one. Peace. Editing more gear. Um, I completely forgot that my roommate also ordered Nespresso with us, so they did not mess up any type of order, it's, it's me.